Ready, set, go. Doesn't have to be vigorously mixed at all. The uh, temperature does matter. For instance, I know you know this like the back of your hand. Um, if you start the day at 70 degrees, 33, did you get something like that? I didn't tell you to start. I thought I said ready, set, go. No problem. What was the number? 33. Um, so let's use 33. We're not going to change. We're just going to act fast, Christopher. So if you start grouting in the morning, it's 70 degrees. By noon, it's 80 degrees. There's a 10 degree temperature and change. What do you think happens to the gel time? Gel time is faster. It's cut, it's, it's cut in half, as a matter of fact. So if I had 33 second gel time here, and it went 10 degrees warmer, the gel time would be 16, 17 seconds. Um, so we always have to be engaged. We always have to know the conditions. We have to stay on top of that. Are you interested in doing this now? You need my help? Okay, we're going to combine side A and side B together, which typically is done at the remote pathway. Yeah, go ahead, Helen. That'd be good. Okay, watch. Watch how quickly it permeates the soil. You can see in the back. Christopher, you're almost there. Hope, oh, oh. uh, One more. We did start the clock again, but someone tell me when it's about 33 seconds from the time we throw it. No, from the time we mixed. You think it kicked already? It's kicking. It's kicking. I'd like to tell you this is a watertight box. It's close. Okay, it is gel. Okay, so can you understand the dynamics of why we want to control that gel time? Because in some cases, after for that DOE project, we had a nine hour gel time. We wanted that material to permeate so deep into the soil that it created a huge barrier to protect some uh, hazardous waste material. <laughs> so, while we are, this is gel, I guess the way to validate this now is to pour more water in. And if we see water coming into the system, shame on us, I don't think that'll happen. Just the right amount of water, very good Chris. You're seeing any penetration of water in the system at all? If we fire up that drill, two minutes from now, we'll all see this water run off, I guess. Can't control that. But we've successfully sealed that bottom. We'll take the sidewalls down, and what remains is a matrix that I think you'll find um, interesting. Much of what we do is invisible. We're trying to create as much visibility in this exercise as possible. Your question. Ah, um, actually, because it's, it's only gel, it's not combined with soil, so it's fluid. It just goes right to the wastewater treatment plant. There's never, ever been a problem with that. This is inert, safe, non-toxic. It's a good question, though. It, it, it was diluted, so it may not be gel. It has no strength. It only gains strength, it only gains strength in, uh, when it combines with soil. In a, a mainline situation, when the packer depresses and moves on, this is kind of like gel is, so it actually just runs it right out.
Scott Kelly, you have a lot of urethane experience. Right? And probably like most about the urethane, probably is uh, its expansion quality. Um, permeating soils are near and dear important to you. Do you think a viscosity of one would help soil permeation go bigger, deeper, further? Yeah. That's what we believe. That's what this does better than any other product that I'm aware of. The excess water is the validation step we went through here. You're right, in the real world, there would be minimal, minimal gel there. And it would just wash away. We've done this with different soil types, clay, sand, and uh, deep gravel that we see here. Not as well as sand. Here's the thing, if water makes it through clay to get into the system, then AB100 can make it back up to the fissures inside clay. Possibly. Possibly. I don't think it's even that necessary. Most municipal grouting applications for mainline would be about 40 seconds. Well, yeah, I guess if you use the blue material, it's like this. The magic number on penetration is soil matrix is about negative 200. So anything above that does a pretty good job of penetrating just like a water plate. Right. So basically anything that's off plates. Right. 200 right. is everything. Anything silt's even. Some, some pretty silt's good. Silt's good. 